Between October 16th and 21st in 2023, Storm Babette saw large waves of the UK experience over 100 millimetres of rain. This came on top of what had already been a very wet autumn, which included Storm Agnes and resulted in record rainfall in parts of England and Scotland. Storm Babette itself resulted in over 3,000 homes and businesses flooded, with thousands more evacuated and tragically three lives lost. It caused at least £500 million of property damage. This was a challenging time for insurers. Once they knew the storm was coming and they could start to activate their event response plans, the geographically widespread impact of a bet meant it was days before they started to fully understand where the flooding was taking place. On October 10th, our meteorology team identified that a powerful rain event was likely. By the 16th of October, which is four days before the start of major flooding in the Angus region of Scotland, we displayed an ISI's flood early warning platform where flooding was likely to take place. This is alongside the Environmental Agency's return period hazard layers. As Babette hit the UK with torrential rain and damaging winds across almost the whole country, ISI's meteorology team, with their 24-7 coverage, had already tasked our satellites with capturing the peak of the flood. Our satellite constellation, with its synthetic aperture radar sensors, also known as SAR sensors, was unimpaired by clouds or the shroud of darkness and provided clear images of the flooding. While mainstream media reported uncertainty about the storm's impact and insurers sought to figure out what was happening, ISAI started gathering precise, observed measurements of the floods as the water started to peak in Angus. Starting October 20th, we provided insurers with daily releases of our flood insights. The daily data releases went on until the end of October, meaning insurers knew where the flooding had occurred and which of their customers were likely to be impacted. Furthermore, they could assess how severe the impact was using our estimation of flood depth, policy by policy, before many of their customers would have had a chance to report their claim. Knowing which customers are impacted and how severely meant that insurers could make critical event response decisions near real time. In the case of Storm Babette, this helped them with adjusting, drying, repairing, and securing temporary accommodation resources ahead of competitors. When the moment came for customers to notify the loss, the claim routing could be accelerated, with the most severely impacted customers identified and fast-tracked. 